What's up everyone? We're going to be trying out the ISO this game. I've been messing around with it for a while, trying to find good attachments for it that actually make it okay. But this gun... Like, this gun is so bad on its own. It needs all the help it can get, to be completely honest. Oh my god. I'd be so mad if I was that dude. I don't know how he lost that gunfight, but he sure did. He lost it pretty bad. Trying to push first. Oh, that was so close. Tried to push respawns there, but we couldn't get him. Oh no. That's probably didn't just come here. But yeah, this gun is kinda a shredder. Not really, but you know. If you play it well, you can do good. But I highly recommend only using this gun on uh, very small maps, like Hagney is a good one. Where's this dude gonna go? He's probably sitting in the next already. I don't really want to challenge him just because he could be sitting up here. Nope, he's not. Where'd he go? Yeah, okay. I thought that's where he was, but I didn't want to push out. I didn't really feel like that was the move. Teammates got me there. But yeah, this gun's kind of a shredder, but like I said, you, you gotta have the right attachments or you're just gonna get completely stomped with it. This is going from the coming from L. Would have thought they would have pushed the other side. It's so hard to flip spawns on this uh, hard point, so I think these people are still just coming from their warehouse over here. Ooh, I shouldn't have pushed out like that. But yeah, we're just trying to trying to use this gun, trying to see if it's actually good with these attachments. I mean, like I said, I've tried out a lot of different variants of this gun, and this seems to be the best one. Oh well, I didn't even kill him. Yeah, see, that's what I mean. You get a lot of hit markers with this gun. It's really not the best, um, but like I said, I, I've been trying to make it work because every gun with the gunsmith thing, you can try and make stuff work. It doesn't always turn out the way you want, but... Whew. Yeah, just some. sometimes you just get so many hit markers, though. Kind of makes it a little tough, but... Oh my god. And this gun falls off at uh, high ranges, so you want to kind of avoid that. You want to play really tight on people. Unless you just have a beamer like me. Then you can kind of chow people like that. I don't want to be here, but I think there's people to my right. I'm always correct. Pick up an actual good gun. I have no ammo in the other one. Need to push over into the warehouse. Let's see if we can get our streaks here. Oh, he was already just sitting there. That hurts. He's actually playing the objective. He's being a good teammate. Oh. Woo. Playing the pole correctly. Oh my god. Two C4s, man. Two? I'm not a C4 player at all. I, I just can't get down with them for some reason. Ooh, ran right into the shotgun, too. This is going to be a tough game. We're going against a uh, clan, I think. So, these dudes are going to be communicating a lot to each other. I'm playing with one of my buddies, but we, we're not talking to each other. We're just climbing. Oh, and they're using trophy systems. This is going to be tough. It's going to be so tough. With the way these dudes are playing, at least... We need to play for spawns now. Get ready. We're about to move. I think they're going to be pushing out bottom L. Friendly UAV online. And just go ahead and push for the hard point. But yeah, these dudes are a team. Yeah, we're actually playing against the whole squad, so this will actually be kind of interesting. Hard point secure. Let's see what we can do against the whole team here. Like I said, this gun is okay. Um, I would only recommend using it on very small maps. UAV ready for the point. Wow. I didn't think I was going to win that gunfight right there. I kind of gave up mid gunfight just because I actually thought I just lost it, but that was a mistake. Completely beamed him. Oh no! Dude, I'm playing with just had no awareness right there, but it's fine. <laughs> Come on.
Come on, Danny. No, there's a dude above me. Oh, we broke it. We broke it. I juke that dude. He had no idea what was going on. Oof. Going back to first hard point. Saw a dude over here. He's probably up top. That's correct. One's top L. We need spawns for the next, though. Probably gonna get called out here. They have a claymore. Uh, you can't slot past claymore is the way I think you could. Oh, what a nade. Don't throw nades like that. Don't do that. We do gotta push for next, though. Only 15 seconds left. We gotta find somewhere. To uh, is he gonna push? Oh, they're already in the max. You gotta just go. Hopefully, uh, me and my teammate can actually do something. No! They're just spawning all over it, so this is gonna be tough. If we push tires here, we might be able to flip spawns. I think we flip spawns right there. Oh my god, there's three of them in there. Playing against clans is always so funny, because they'll all sit in the hard point like that. 29 seconds. Let's see, now they're going to be looking bottom. Oh no, and there's a dude sitting in there with just a rod shield. Yep, um, alright, now we got to go mid-map, which they have the spawns for, so... This isn't the greatest. Look at this man. Look at this man. He tried. Oh wow. Thought I killed the dude in the back. Like I said, I mean, I'm giving you great examples of why this gun isn't that great. Like, I'm shooting people so many times and not getting anything for it. I'm surprised I actually killed both of them right there. Yeah, this gun just needs a little help. Like, if they had, like, an ammunition attachment that gave it some damage, that'd be super nice. Because, like I said, it falls off at uh, high ranges, and at a certain point, you just really can't do anything with it. I'm beaming kids right now, though. Like I said, you can make it work. Don't get me wrong. Like, like I said, you can make this gun work. No way. No way. These dudes are getting so lucky on me. Really interfering with my kill streaks. I'm trying to get here. Although it seems like they would immediately just take them down. Yep. We want this spawn for next anyway. They're winning though. So, let's see if we can actually. Stop them from winning here. Nobody's pushing mid. Nope. Oh, there's three pushing mid. I was very wrong. Still 30 seconds left on this hard point, though. Hard point contested. We control the hard point. Now we should really be looking to rotate. I think they're all going mid map. Spawning L, maybe. Bottom L, seems. Hard point contested. Where are these dudes at? Nope. Throw a nade. Stop anybody else trying to cross from there. For the meantime, they're all just pushing this way. They might have already gotten across. There's another one, and there's one here. Oof. I need my teammates to actually help me out. And they got spawns. They're just playing this so much better, but like I said, they can communicate with each other. They have no gun skill though. I'm not gunning them in pretty much most gunfights where it's not just completely unfair like that. He was gonna win that gunfight every single time. Let's see if we're gonna actually do anything. 
here. He's just sitting in the corner. <gasps> How hard is it to kill somebody with a riot shield, yo? That's hilarious. That's comical. They're rotating. Yeah, all they gotta do here is rotate. You gotta get on. I'm surprised he didn't just kill me. I gotta go big for the team here. Oh no. Oh no. I think we might just lose here. Yeah, this is tough. We kinda just gotta flood in. Oh no. went off this but I gotta push to the other side. Now we win. Now I think we just take the win here. L Oh no Actually no we we can't win. We actually oh my god my teammates are geniuses He big brained it Oh my god, what a game. What a game. Look at me. <laughs> 25 seconds in the hard point doing everything for the team. That was an entertaining game. And look at Danny getting the final kill. My boy. Using the Grok class I gave him. 56 and 21, not bad. Uh, my teammates were actually pretty good. I can't talk crap, like I said. I could have done a little bit more objectively. But the ISO's not bad, guys. I mean, I, I top the charts and kills, at least. So, I mean, if you shoot straight, there's a good chance you can actually do pretty well with the gun. But it just loses so many gunfights where you think you're going to win it. And, like I said, in some of those gunfights, I kind of just gave up midway through because I thought I was going to lose them, but I ended up winning. I think this gun really relies on you having an accurate shot and the other people just not shooting at you sometimes. But here's the class if you want it. Barrel, Revolution. I've tried out the Nightshade, but I think the Revolution Barrel is just better. Um, Vagrant for the stock. It's pretty much your um, close quarter stock on other guns. Um, I would use Collapsible, but I just feel like my shot is a little shaky. Too shaky with that. Um, rear Grip, you want to go ISO Grip, which is pretty much stifled. Pretty standard. Ammunition, you want 30 round mags. You can run 50 rounds, but I think it just slows down your... Um, I think it just slows down your your aim down side speed a little too much. And under barrel, Merc 4 grip. Merc is just overpowered on some machine guns. Merc 4 grip honestly is kind of a cheat code. <laughs> I would I would use this on all your submachine gun classes just because it's so good. You can actually fight ARs and win with a sub if you have Merc 4 grip on. That's why it's banned in uh in competitive. It just makes some machine guns too good. Yeah, here's the class, guys. Please use it. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any other iterations of this class, let me know. Because, like I said, I've been trying out different things, and this is just the one that feels the best. This is the one I can get consistent plays with. Um, yeah. Like I said, I, I tried out the night Nightshade just because it's like the integrated monolithic suppressor, but it's it's just, like I said, I don't feel like I beam people the way I should. But, yeah, guys. We're going to end the video here. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you want to subscribe, please do. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.